Meet Maisie. Maisie is a Border Terrier. For most of her breed's existence, the Border Terrier has been unknown, and her people prefer that she stay that way, if it means protecting her from the ravages of popularity. She's intelligent, loyal, fearless, loving, and determined, and is about as aggravating as any dog can be. The Border Terrier may well be one of the oldest terriers in Great Britain, but for many of you, this may be the first you've heard of her. Let's get to know this spunky little pest. Hi, I'm Leroy. And I'm Rosie. And this is Animal Facts. Let's get started. But before we start, take a moment to like and subscribe for more fun, fun facts. Let's know about your doggy in the comments below. Number 10. The Border Terrier originated in the Cheviot Hills in Great Britain that formed the border country between England and Scotland, a region also inhabited by powerful hill foxes, a menace to farm stock. To keep these foxes in check, farmers and shepherds needed a plucky terrier, leggy enough to follow a horse, but small enough to follow a fox into dens and brush. The border had to be strong and tireless with a weather-resistant coat to withstand the mist and bone-soaking rains of the Cheviot Hills. This small, hardy, working terrier could be found in the homes of almost all border farmers, shepherds, and sportsmen. Often she was used in conjunction with border foxhounds. The border terrier was likely named for this association with the border foxhounds. We publish every Monday and Friday, so hit that notification icon to not miss a single fact. Number 9 Considering that she's a terrier, the Border Terrier is good-tempered, affectionate, obedient, and easily trained. She's highly intelligent and quickly learns the cues that signal you're going outside for a walk or to the office, when it's mealtime, and what you like and don't like her to chew. Except for socks, maybe. Someone hasn't quite figured out I like my socks intact. Number 8 one of the unique features of the Border Terrier is her loose-fitting hide. Whereas the term coat refers to a dog's hair, pelt or hide refers to her skin, which should be thick and movable. In fact, the only Terrier standard that calls for a loose hide is the Border Terrier. This characteristic protects her from any bites or scratches and allows her to wiggle in and out of tight underground tunnels. The only way to truly test the height of a Border Terrier is to grasp it gently over the back with both hands and lift it slightly. Number 7 Since the Border Terrier was bred to work alongside Border Foxhounds, she is less dog aggressive than some other terriers that hunted on their own. The Border Terrier doesn't have the fiery, ready-to-go personality that some people look for in a Jack Russell Terrier or Rat Terrier but this allows her to easily live calmly with other dogs. Number 6 As a breed, the Border Terrier has changed very little over the years, aside from becoming more consistent in appearance. This is mostly due to the fact that she has lived and bred in relative obscurity. She's not as flashy as many of her terrier relatives, in fact, she could be easily mislabeled as a little wiry mutt by the uninitiated, but she's a purebred terrier with all the gusto and wits of her more popular cousins. Number 5 With her family, she's affectionate but self-reliant. Thanks to her intelligence, good-tempered nature, and willingness to work, the Border can adapt to life in any environment, city or country, and is highly trainable. The Border Terrier loves kids and can match their energy levels and play drive all day long, but she can be a little rambunctious for households with small children. Expect your Border Terrier to be part of your family for 13 to 14 years. Number 4 The Border Terrier does not need to be bathed often, only when she's gotten into something gross and it's really necessary. Her coat naturally repels dirt, and with weekly brushings and a wipe down with a damp cloth when needed, it should stay fairly clean. When you do bathe her, use a shampoo made for the rough terrier coat to help maintain its texture. Number 2 
She's a truly low maintenance dog when it comes to her hair and sheds little. The Border Terrier's coat needs weekly brushing and periodic stripping, removing the dead hair by hand or with a stripping tool to maintain its trademark rough texture. You can clipper the coat, but the texture and color will become softer and lighter and the coat won't be weather resistant. If you love the scruffy look, you can just leave her coat as is, with no stripping or clipping, but the coat may shed a little more. Number two. She should not be let off leash, for there is no terrier more determined to explore and pursue anything that runs except perhaps for the Jack Russell. There's a link to that video in the card. The Border Terrier is so inquisitive, some get themselves wedged into tight holes or crawl spaces trying to find out what's in there. A secure yard or kennel run is essential for this breed. She is a proven escape artist, an able jumper, and a proficient digger. Hey guys, we've been working on our Patreon page, and hope you'll check it out at patreon.com slash animal facts. Number one. Your Border Terrier is more willing to work with you than many other Terriers. Many excel at the highest level of obedience and agility competition, but the toughness that makes her suited for ridding farms of vermin can frustrate you when she decides to be stubborn. She has a mind of her own, and while she will listen to the command, She'll often choose on her own when to obey it. Want more fun final facts? Go ahead and smash that subscribe button and hit the notification icon to not miss a single fact. If you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. Hey, this button works. Or that other button also works. If you'd like to help us grow, consider becoming a patron on Patreon or clicking the PayPal link on animalfacts.us. And as always, catch you next time.